All right, I'm going to talk about Rosie O'Donnell real quick, y'all. And her saying, the hell with this Hollywood conspiracy theories bullshit. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I do the same shit with black people. When they sit around and say, look, it must be white people's fault because we just... No, 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 no. I'm not letting you get away with this shit, Rosie O'Donnell. What the hell are y'all doing to people out there in Hollywood? What are y'all doing out there in Hollywood to people that they say, fuck it, there's nothing else I can do except kill myself? You can't keep saying that it's, it's a conspiracy theory. All right, take away it's a conspiracy theory. Y'all motherfuckers, excuse my language, people. I'm sorry, I'm going to cuss a lot in this video if you don't curse. I'm sorry. Y'all are doing something to people that are telling them my only option is say, fuck it. <laughs> you can sit there and talk all that bullshit about mental health. Why does mental health exist? I want everybody to answer that question right now. Why does mental health exist? Stress, money, situation. Like, mental health exists because of the shit that goes on around you. That's why it, it, it exists. What, what are y'all doing to this man? She, she was on a show with, or him and his wife was on a show with, and they asked him about the Ellen DeGeneres thing or whatever. And he said, I can't comment on it legally. Did y'all know that he knew too much? Did he say, fuck it, I know how y'all do black men. So y'all going to try and Bill Cosby me? They seen, He seen what they did to R. Kelly. Was he a part of some of the wild shit that went on behind the scenes? And he know how the motherfuckers are in Hollywood. They're dropping on somebody else and give them 100 years in jail rather than saying they was the ones behind it. Like what? Like what is going on? I'm not saying it is a conspiracy theory. It could be some bullshit where he was just like, fuck it, I'm killing myself. But at the same time, why every time we turn around, somebody randomly ends up missing dead or killed in Hollywood. And even when they talk about Robin Williams or whatever his name was, he didn't get along with a lot of Hollywood elite. And it showed how he got tired of a lot of bullshit. When you listen to some of the comedians and some of the artists that are in Hollywood... You always hear about this person who lives on a ranch in this state that not many people live in or this Midwest state because they say they just got to get away from Hollywood every once in a while. And what I think is funny about Rosie O'Donnell right now is you don't even like Ellen DeGeneres. It's articles all over the damn internet where you talking about we ain't friends no more because this, this, and that. Now all of a sudden you want to come to the defense of Hollywood? Come on, man. Cut the bullshit. There's something going on out there. Y'all can sit around and say that mental health all you want. What is causing people's mental health to do this shit? It's people that live in third world countries. Just live off the land. It's people who just go to church every week. Let it be damn near 100 years old. All of y'all know y'all got that person in y'all community that's been going to church every damn week. That's Miss So-and-so. She was old when I was in elementary school. She's still walking around this mother effing. She 90. We all got that. And they, she go to church every week. Or she go to the mosque. Or she Jehovah's. Whatever. She do the same damn thing every week. And she always helping people out and giving money to the neighborhood. And even the gangsters in the neighborhood don't mess with her. Because she just been there forever. Everybody know that one damn person. But they magically can live all these years without mental health issues. But all of a sudden, somebody with the likes and the love that Twitch got just say F it. Y'all doing something. Mental health comes from the mental stress that you son of a bitches out there in Hollywood put on people. Or the stipulations y'all do to people. And know that they can fuck with their family and their life if they don't do something that y'all want them to do when y'all doing slime ball shit. I'm out, man. Shit is crazy.